Hey gamers, Triple Xbox One here. The Destiny Beta has finally arrived on Xbox One and I jumped straight on it as soon as it arrived, got into the missions. I'm on the third mission now on Earth. This is called The Dark Within. I'm doing it as my hunter and I'm doing it solo on the harder level, trying to get as much XP as possible to get up to the highest level that we can, which I, I believe eight in the beta. I'm not 100% on that, but I think it is eight we can get up to. But if I unlock as much XP as possible, I can try out as many characters as I want and as many combinations of the kit that I can lay my hands on. It's all very exciting. It looks fantastic, absolutely awesome graphically. The sound is great as well. Now I've got my headphones on at the minute and I'm really enjoying this. Straight into the Lunar Complex. Gets a bit crazy straight away. Now, I've gone over land already, missed out that boring bit. We're inside the building now. This is where all the bad guys start turning up. And these guys, the Fallen, they are just relentless. They do not care about your weaponry. They just want your blood. I've only just started and they're dropping off around the corner here. As you can see, it's a hit, HP hit point uh, based shooting arrangement we've got. So you'll take a little bit of damage off them and they'll let you know how much you're taking off with each shot. So I think that's knocking in the 70s for headshots and around about the 24s for body shots. Um, and that this works for all of the different bosses as well. And they have weak points, joints, bellies. Keep your eyes out for them. Very intricate game, it's gonna take a lot of learning. Not a lot of learning, you're gonna fall in and play this game as soon as you pick it up, but there's a lot of depth gonna to come to it. So uh, yeah, really exciting game, looking forward to it. The wizards here. That's right, there are wizards here in Destiny have to deal with all these minions they will be relentless there's another wave of them in there gradually take them out or they'll take you out the boss the wizard he levitates a little bit he throws balls of looks like electric energy towards you and they really do knock down your health so be wary of those you can see him sort of powering them up in the balls of light in his hands I'll deal with these guys who want to come play. I have no shame in backing off. Know your environment. Know where the safe spots are when you're going to a battle there. Susceptible to a knife in the back. It does bring you a little bit close to him, but just run away. Get yourself a nice bit of cover again. Look at the graphics, man. This looks so, so, so sweet. Sweet black honey. Go for another stab. Like to get hands on, down, dirty, and personal. Hold no respect for the bosses. They have none for you. And I have to finish him off with a sniper. A little bit of long range. He did get me a few times during the fight. Took about 10 minutes in total, I think. I know he's near the end, so I'm just going to go cautious. Finish him off. I've got his shields nicely down. Still dangerous. You get that nice little sound, that victory sound. Just to let you know you've done so well. Mission complete. When you finish the mission, you will have 30 seconds to have a quick scout around the area to see if you can find anything of interest. I don't think I found much, so I just got my two rewards for completing the mission. I hope you've enjoyed this very short video. Go get the Destiny beta, get in it, enjoy it, get the game, it's going to blow your minds. Peace out gamers.